So now we are done making our beautiful bag. So we are going to make the ando now. Very simple ando you can make on your bag. So keep watching guys. Thank you so much for your support. Now for the side, we have um, five roll. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So it's very, very easy. For the, from the five bead, you skip the first one. The first one at the hedge right now. So we are going to make our matting on this three bead. One, two, three. We skip this bead and this one right here. So this three bead is the one we are working on. Okay. So now guys, I cut a new fire line. Like I said, we are only working on this three bead. We are skipping this first ones. Okay. And on this three bead. Now I'll work my line through the bead right here. And I'll hold both ends of the line. I make sure I have equal length. All right. So guys. This stands for my left hand line and this stands for my right hand line. Okay. Now in my left hand line, I'm going to insert three beads. Okay. And we are using our normal looping metal. All right. So I pick three beads and insert it in my left hand line. Then in this third bead, I'll form my loop. I pass my line back into the bead. Okay. So form the loop. Once I have formed the loop, then I'll cross my right hand line in the loop like so, and then pull it down. So this is what we have, all right, for the side. Now I'm just going to drag the loop side in the bead. And this is what we have, okay? So now my right hand line, I'll pass it through the next bead right here. Once that is done, my left hand line, I will insert two beads. So I pick two beads and insert it in my left hand line. I form my loop. Cross my right hand line in the loop. And pull it down. My right hand line into the third bead. Okay. So now this is where I am going to turn. So in my right hand line, I will insert two bead. I pick two bead and insert it in my right hand line. Then I'll form my loop in the second bead. After forming my loop, I pass my left hand line in the loop like so. Pull it. Make sure your work is tight and this is what we have okay this is what we have for the side bag okay now i'm going to turn at this point now in my right hand line i'm going to insert three beads i pick three beads and insert it in my right hand line then i'll form my loop in the third bead I'll then cross my left hand line in the third in the loop, okay, and pull it. Pull it tight, okay, and this is what we have. All right, at this point, I'll pass my left hand line into the third bead, okay. So this is what we have, okay. Now in my left hand line, I will insert two beads. I pick up two bead and insert it in my left hand line. Then I'll form my loop. Then cross my right hand line in the loop and pull it down. Okay. And this is what we have. Okay, as you can see, we have started the matting for the for the handle okay very very easy okay this is what we have so we are going to continue our matting all right until we get to the length of the handle that we want it is very very easy normal way of matting so continue this until you get to the length of the handle that you want okay so guys um i've been to this length okay so i have 50 
kategor, I have 50. So depending on how long you want your handle to be, okay? So, but this is 50, all right? So now let's just attach this point together, okay? So just keep watching. So at this point, make sure you have it straight like this, okay? Then the figure, the three points, the three sides, okay? We have one, two, three, four, five. So we are going to skip this one and this one and we are working on this three okay so this is what we have now in my left hand line i'm going to insert one bead okay so i pick one bead and insert it in the left hand line and the left the same left hand line then i'll pass it through i'll skip this and work it through the second one like so and then pull it down so this is what we have as you can see now i'll pick one bead so i pick one bead and i'm going to cross both line in this one bead all right yeah i form my loop then pass my left hand line in the loop like so and then pull it down okay and this is what we have okay so my right hand line i'll pass it through this bead and my left hand line into this bead okay and this is what i have all right now i'll pick one bead i'll pick one bead and cross both line in this one bead okay and pull it down it so tight all right so we have this then my right hand line into this bead my left hand line into this bead okay and this is what we have all right now i'll cross both line in one bead again so i pick one bead and i'm going to cross both line in this one bead i form my loop then pass my left hand line in the loop like so and pull it down then drag this point in like so make sure your work is tight okay so this is what we have as you can see we have fixed it like that so what i'm going to do now is these lines i'm going to work it through these beads again these beads like that like that so i'm going to work it like that so i can have double line in the beads right here okay so lovelies i'm done passing um the line through the beads and both line are now meeting at this point as you can see so now i'm just going to knot it and after knotting it i'm going to secure the line by working it through some beads as well okay so guys this is what we have and we are done fixing our handle as you can see you see how beautiful it is this is so firm and then perfect so we are done making our beautiful beaded bag rock this on any of your outfit as you can see it is black and it doesn't select i hope you love today's tutorial please like comment subscribe i am open to suggestions and ideas okay thank you all so much for watching and i will see you all in my next video Bye-bye.